this week, Joe Burrow said he needed to play near perfect if the Bengals wanted to beat their divisional rivals. He threw for a record day yesterday, 392 yards, five touchdowns. That's a career high from number nine with a passer rating of 137. That is darn near perfect. Yet it all unravels in a series of deflating fourth quarter and overtime events, which we will be highlighting if this season doesn't turn around in Cincinnati down the stretch. Three different 10 point leads in the second half and the Bengals couldn't put this thing on ice. Outside of Lamar Jackson dropping a snap, the Bengals defense had nothing to show for after halftime. Bengals defense allowed 520 yards of total offense from Baltimore. It's a glaring weakness through five weeks. Burrow in the offense, they have scored 105 points over the last three weeks and have just one win to show for it. Nothing in the division. A brutal three point loss in overtime to the Ravens yesterday. Is this locker room frustrated with a one and four hole that they're going to have to dig themselves out of? We're not a championship level team right now. We're not. Um, you know, I, I like to think that, you know, we'll come back and improve throughout the season to, to get to that point. But right now we are not. Obviously something has to change. You know, I'm, I'm not sure what that is on our end. We'll, uh, We'll do some critical thinking, watch the tape, and see where we could have done better. There's plenty to improve on. It's sick to my stomach for our guys in there. They, they fought, proud of them. Uh, but we got to find a way to win. We can't keep coming up one play short, and that's really what the game came down to. You're not going to see a lot of guys sitting in here just feeling sorry for ourselves. And so people can write us off if they really want to. Um, I'm not dumb enough to do that. A powerful postgame message there from head coach Zach Taylor, who is taking heat for the conservative play calling it in overtime yesterday. That's fair, but the reality is this Bengals defense, it's a real problem, and they've suffered another major injury. Cornerback Dax Hill left in the first quarter with a knee injury, and postgame, Coach Taylor saying if it is a bad injury, it's heartbreaking for Hill.